which one of the following has an optical isomer means of all these structures the one which has an optical isomer is now students what is required for optical isomerism for a molecule to be uh, to have or to be optically active it is required that it should not have symmetry any sort of symmetry neither the plane of symmetry nor the axis of symmetry first thing and it should form the mirror image so of this i can just pick out this where there are the ligands bidentate ligands are present it makes the molecule more optically active say if i am adding the co this is one this is the another one this is the another one right so this is and its mirror image what would be its mirror image this doesn't have any excess of symmetry the mirror image would be there is co3 plus there would be co3 plus right there is gan en and here it's this thing again e yeah. right now let's take out so this is your answer but let's work out for the another options say your zinc ethylene diamine and ammonia okay so what will be the structure this is your option b which was the correct it is optically active now students if i to take up the first option that is a this is zinc 2 plus right and there are en and i have got 1 nh3 and here again the nh3 right now this is what this is a tetrahedral with a plane of symmetry right this this has got a plane of symmetry with it so it is tetrahedral it is not no non superimposable images are formed now if i take up the c what will c cobalt with water molecules so it is cobalt h2o whole 4 ethylene diamine and this is 3 plus so if i draw the structure what will be the structure of the students there will be cobalt at the center that is 3 plus right we have got an h2o over here H2O over here. Here also there is H2O. Here also there is H2O, and we have got one ethylene diamine. Will it be optically active? No, because it has the plane as well as the axis of symmetry, right? This is horizontal plane of symmetry is present. right so this is also not optically active now what about the fourth option this is also symmetrical say our zn is at the center and we have got the ethylene diamine this is also symmetrical vertical axis of symmetry right 
So what is the right option? B. So students do remember in case of octahedral complexes or the in case of complexes where the coordination number is 6, if the bidentate ligands are present, all are bidentate, pick out as, as a optically active compound.